There's been great controversy over the $6 billion of Iranian money that was unfrozen recently. Um, the U.S. has apparently now um, moved to stop the distribution of that money by Qatar, which was uh, responsible. Was that a, an acknowledgment that Iran might have been involved in this attack? Well, two things here. First, when it comes to uh, Iran and its, its uh, possible involvement, Iran's had a long relationship with Hamas. Uh, Hamas wouldn't be Hamas without the support over many, many years from Iran. Um, and so we know that, uh, we see that. When it comes to this specific attack, in this moment, we don't have direct evidence that uh, Iran was involved in the attack, either in planning it or carrying it out. But that, that could change. And as I said, there's a much longer complicity between uh, Iran and uh, Hamas that uh, the world knows. And it's one of the reasons that uh, since this administration has been in office, we've um, sanctioned Iran individuals, companies, uh, more than 400 times, including for support to, uh, to Hamas. Now, when it comes to the $6 billion, it's important to be very clear because unfortunately, uh, some people are either misinformed or they're misinforming. Uh, the money in question, Iranian money, not American taxpayer dollars, is money that was allowed to accrue in a bank account from the sale of Iranian oil. And that mechanism, allowing Iran to accrue this money, to get the money and have it in an account, was established by the Trump administration. Now, the account that it was established in, in South Korea, for technical reasons, uh, Iran was having trouble actually using the funds, which it's always been allowed to use for humanitarian purposes. Under our sanctions, under our laws, we always carve out humanitarian food, medicine, medical equipment. So. What we did is we moved the money from one account uh, in South Korea to another account in Qatar where the money could actually be used, but under the supervision of our Treasury Department, only for humanitarian purposes, and not a dollar of that money has been spent to date. And we retain the right to freeze that account. And is that, so what, you, is that what you have technically done now by stopping distribution from that, that account? Uh, as I said, there has been no distribution of the accounts. There wasn't a question of stopping it. There hasn't been any. Um, and we retain the right to formally freeze it. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.